to Larch am Rhein, which is Larch on the Rhine, the famous river. That's the one. And Jonathan, you'll be playing at the Rheingau Festival. I believe you've just got a brochure there. Can I see the front page of that, please? It's a big brochure because it's one of the biggest music festivals in Europe. And Jonathan will be performing a lovely organ recital there. Four seasons. Anyway, we'll be on our way. And I think we might see some wonderful scenery along the way. This is nice. A quality continental pillow. They've got um, a robot lawnmower, Jonathan. A view from the window. We've got a map of the area. Here we go. And now we're going to find the church. I'd just like to announce that I have a new case. Oh, it's a very smooth trundle. Yeah. We're going to go head up there through the church. Oh, we're climbing church. It's, it's the town hall everyone. Brown and white architecture. So welcome to St Martin's Church here in Lorsch and Ryan. Wonderful. Now it isn't open to the public um, but I have a key so I'll show you something very beautiful. Are you coming to the concert? I think you might be coming to the concert. He's, he's there for the duration. Of great historical importance is the altar, which is one of the oldest examples of a carved old altar in monochrome. It's kind of a very dinky chamber of it. It's cute, isn't it? Well, it has to be plugged in. Let's go upstairs and see Jonathan. See how he's getting on on this uh, pipe organ. It's an amazing old timber up here. We're almost there. Here he is. Let me just show you the case. It's in the corner of the room, Jonathan. It was rebuilt in 1984. 1984, fantastic. So the, the bottom manual is your help, but... Yeah. Down here. You, what you expect. The trumpet. So the next manual then is the swell, which has got some of the original uh, sort of no, uh, more sort of German romantic strings and mm -hmm. sort of nice sounds, yeah. Also sort of quite a neo-baroque. The top manual is the positive, yes. which is just above my head. That's yeah. the, it's very cool. Oh yeah, I can hear that. Yeah, it's very cool. Oh, uh, You know what, it's got a really nice sound to it. There's a stop on this oh, organ, which we've been excited about knowing what it is. And okay, here's the stop here's two the rank Riesling stop. Two rank Riesling stop. Okay. We're on the Rhine. Indeed, we are on the Rhine, Jonathan. So here's the cupboard. We've not actually tried this yet. Uh, so we? you pull the stop out, off you go. Are you ready for this? Yeah. And two wine glasses. A nightingale stop, but there's four bottles of wine in there, two glasses. That is a, a very nice, <laughs> it's a party in, a, in an organ, isn't it? I'll tell you what you'd be able to tell if you were opening that cupboard well, it with that, that sound. It depends whether they use it in the, in the concert. Well, Jonathan, I think you should use it in the concert. <laughs> well, I think we should use it many times in the concert. <laughs> so. What does it sound like downstairs? Yeah, it? but it sounds really good. I'll have a listen. It's anyway, loud here, if that is different. It is. Well, basically, that was your quick tour. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Is it the River Whisper? Uh, Visper. Visper. Apparently that is the nicest renaissance building. Beautiful, stunning. I don't need to say that, do I? We're here on the River Rhine. 
I'm putting some river rind facts on now. Gosh, that's interesting. I would never have thought that. Can you believe that, Jonathan? We are having our dinner under the vines. And look, it's schnitzel. I'm going to have to go through all the different types of wine press. This is also a very fine example. I'm learning all sorts about wine presses. Do you know what type this is, Jonathan? It's a green one. <laughs> Great concert, Jonathan. Thank you. Um, what did you get? A box. A box? What's in a the box? box? Two bottles of Riesling. Ah, fantastic. There you Rain go, so you didn't need that stop after all. I feel very welcome now. We have arrived in Vauvan. It's beautiful here, actually. Um, I've just found a little poster for Jonathan's concert. It's nice, isn't it? It's very much like an archetypal French little village. It has everything, which is French. Creperie, Le Café, the Boulangerie Patisserie. We were supposed to learn French before coming here. I haven't. I've learned that uh, local pigeon is pigeon locale. Should we walk to the castle, everyone? Let's go. Let me show you this scene. This is absolutely stunning. And they built the castle in one evening. Well, I never. It was built in one night by a serpent fairy. It is like something out of a fairy tale. Tour. Tour. What's this gone? Le Grand Tour. We will come back tomorrow and Sorry. climb this beautiful monument. Ah, La Maison. It's a very musical maison. We have a wonderful music room with harmonium and piano. We'll see you tomorrow. I'll take you to see the church and the beautiful organ, which is very, very new, but very, very beautiful. Le café. Bonjour, Jonathan. Je très bien dormi. I slept very well. Anyway, so we've got an exciting day today. What's going on today, Jonathan? Apart from you making us a wonderful breakfast. Um, TV are coming to film. Oh, film you playing the organ yes. in the wonderful church across the way, which is actually based on the choir organ of Nantes Cathedral. So I'll show you a picture of that now. And then we're going to look at the church and the wonderful organ. Do you know what type of flowers they are, Jonathan? Um, uh, I dream. This is a very quick carpentry service. of wood sorted. Benches being removed so we can get a better filming angle. What do you think about that? Again, attention to detail. Now Eve's cleaned the floor. I mean, more attention to detail. Would you like to tell us a little bit about it? Well, it was completed and opened in 2021. It's built by Yves Fossard. It's a fairly local to this area. Yes. And it's built in a very French style, but it uses a lot of extension and uh, 
the same stops over and over. So it's actually only got 18 stops in total. Just 18 stops. Which, when you couple them all together, is this. They're made available very cleverly. So things like uh, the pedal is just one octave. That one octave is the pedal. Mm -hmm. But then it uses the flute on the grate. It's the same stop. And so they're, they're connected together to give you more stops. So you've got a resonance on the top manual, which has two separate opening boxes. Yes. So instead of it just opening at the front, we can have it. So, so I put that on. I can open the swell at the back. Should I, let's go around the back, I'll show you this. Jonathan, open it round the back and I'll show you the back of the organ here. Here we go. Uh, the strings, you've also got your typical French car. And the clarinet. Just to be clear, you can have a different sound at any dividing point in the uh, pedal. Yeah, so if I wanted to have a bass, but I also wanted to come. I yes. wanted to play the solo with my right foot. Possibilities. Possibilities, Jonathan. Yeah, so you get an extra, so you can have two hands and thumb, and then you have another solo. So you can play five, five parts. Six oh. parts, seven Wait, parts. If, if, you, if you can, you can. <laughs> oh, Jonathan, play me a lovely big sound on this organ. Let's all hear it and, uh, and, and see what we think. Jonathan is creating an arrangement. Jonathan, what are you writing out? Uh, my vocal aid. Dedicated to the art of the transcription. <laughs> The most stunning flowers I've seen on the vlog, I think, so far. Do you not agree, Jonathan? I'm not sure we have reached the chain boat. You might as well have a quick go on it, Jonathan. We haven't got time to go across. Well, that's fun, isn't it? Oh. <laughs> We've got to visit the tower we saw at the beginning of our first trip here. It's called um, the Melusine Tower. So, we have a key. <laughs> okay. Oh, we love to, we really do love to climb. Here we go. We sort of found this slightly alarming. <laughs> <laughs> Without this, who knows what would happen. Are you going to go first? No. If you, if you want, okay. Oh, so. a bit oh, that's a nice bit of light. Oh, we've got some. Oh, it's fitted with uh, some lovely lighting as well. Oh, yes. Oh, very nice. Oh, look at this. This is so cool. Here, and I think there's a fireplace in here. The first view. Look at this. Oh, what we've done with the place. I love <laughs> it. It has got. Yeah. Jonathan points out it's got a domed ceiling. Here we go. The second floor. Picture of um, a melusine. Oh, there, as you can see. And here we are. Here you go. Here you go, a medieval toilet. As you can see, some light. Now, oh, there's a gate here. And we open it. And here we are, at the top. One last little view. Bonsoir, mesdames et messieurs. Et bienvenue. C'est ton grand plaisir. Très bien. Très bien. Merci, merci, merci. For years when you come to France and you say, 
they want an encore. They don't say encore, they call it a bis. A bis. I always thought encore was the French word for encore. <laughs> yeah, I did as well. No. Yeah. <laughs> Bonjour. Bonjour. Now, on our channel, we have never featured a cavalier call organ from a French cathedral, but that's all going to change today as we travel to Lausanne. There it is. the cab I got. Uh, it needs a bit of work as you can tell. Anyway, let's go and see the choir organ. So uh, plan B, we're here at the, uh, the, the choir organ here. A local maker from Nantes. <laughs> we're back upstairs. The bonnet's been up, now it's back down. Some work has been done. The cab I call. Wonderful. Look at this in 1855. I can sense the history on these keys. I can see the <laughs> history the on. Keys. I can see the history on these keys. 1885, did you say? So it's four manuals. Yes. So originally, the third manual was just a free read, which is somewhere else now, okay. and that's been replaced. Yes. So the top manual is the Resi mm -hmm. and the positive. Yep. And the positives here, and then the grand. And these are all the ventors. It seems to be quite a lot on this organ. Okay. So we have a. The positive section here at the front, which I'm going to have now. Look at this. The cloister with pigeon locale. I can hear them, but I can't see them. Waited a long time to see a local pigeon. I finally got to see one. Scheduled arrival, 11.58 a.m. Caution, the train is arriving. You join us at the station. We're in Dusseldorf. It's about Bahnhof. Yeah, well, we've stopped from French to German because we're going to go to Münster for a very exciting concert. Now this is all about beautiful places and pipe organs and there's a wonderful, beautiful pipe organ in Münster. There are three cages on the side of this tower. I will show you them in detail very soon. Okay. Let's go and see Jonathan in the organ loft. A bit of climbing to do. We have to go down here. As you can see. Shamards. Hello. Playing your shamards just while we're here. <laughs> this organ um, is no stranger to our channel because we have put it on oh, before. Here before, haven't we? A yes. Shuka organ. Jonathan is setting it's up. Very like good. It's very good. It's very powerful. It's mechanical, but there's a few extras on it as well. Okay. Got some bells. Oh, bells, yes. Tubular bells. A 
at the front. Sound. Uh, Beautiful. Uh, so you can't like the symbols there. Uh-huh. Four divisions, the positive's right behind me. It's a very big positive. Well, we've just we've just heard it from downstairs and it sounds absolutely immense yeah. in terms of sound for this. You can also wear headphones because there's some microphones there. You can hear what it sounds so like. So there you go. Put those on, Jonathan. See what you look like with them. Absolutely ridiculous. Who said that? I'm going to record a very special piece which is linked to this church. What yes. is that, Jonathan? Adnos by List. It's about... It's the story of Munster. It is. Yes. The... The John of Leiden yes. came, they took over and made themselves King of Munster. That's right. And then there's some rather grisly <laughs> cages on the side of there the is, tower. There is, on the side of the tower, which we're going to go and well, see. I don't know what they are, but they are, it's a true story. Then we are going to play a piece which requires myself, me, <laughs> to play the nightingale whistle. So, um, have you got that with you now? It's in the back. <laughs> okay. Oh. <laughs> you never lose it. <laughs> you never lose it. Okay, everyone, I'm taking Jonathan up the tower. Let's go, Jonathan. Do okay. my legs. Oh, do you know what? I think it's a bit of a trek. How long is it? Oh, do you know Cologne Cathedral? It's not as big as that. It's not as big as that. Um, but anyway, so we start our journey. Of course, you've got to do this before you check into your hotel. <laughs> yeah. These are heavy duty doors, Jonathan. Okay. Just close that one. So, this is actually where the bell tower to ring the bells was, as we can see. That's all right. What do you think, Jonathan? Very nice. This was the original tower for the church. And that's the bell. This bell, here we go. Oh, exciting, so look at the ascent begins. It's nice how they put pictures on the wall every now and again. I think we're about halfway there now. Now, apparently the bell, the bell is in here. Let's not go in there. You won't want to do this to all before you come. Oh, my legs are killing me. Right. Okay. Here we are. We've reached the door. And here we go. So. Here we are. We have reached the top of the tower. It's good, isn't it? There is someone who is in charge of looking out at the city at night. It's like a, a fire watch person. It's actually a, uh, a woman who does that. So Marta, I was hoping to see it, but we haven't. So hello, Marta, if you're watching this vlog. Now, if there's any problems, apparently she rings that bell. I better not ring it now because it will summon the fire brigade probably. Okay, now, these, Jonathan, are the cages and I've been informed that they are the original cages from... From the 1500s. From the 1500s. The Anabaptists who took over this town, John of Leiden and his crew, basically were put in these cages after they had been killed. They have these lights which shine at night to kind of represent the departed souls. And over there, which we'll try and visit tomorrow, Jonathan, there is the cathedral. Okay, on our way to the cathedral, we have a few people who watch this vlog who are really interested in um, clocks. Oh, someone's sneezing. <laughs> in, I'll say that again, in clocks and watches. Clocks and watches, same thing. So, this is for you. Time pieces. Time pieces, yes. points to the, the day and the month. Yeah. He points to the year. And he points to the year. That is absolutely. Isn't that incredible? Jonathan's just doing a few pre-flight checks. <laughs> is that right, Jonathan? It's all good. All good to go. Done. Nice audience, Jonathan.
Now that's the sound of Marta uh, doing the, the fire watch to horn sound. There you go. What do you think about that? Oh, someone's joined in on a car. Okay, so obviously we, we can't get home. So we've got a holiday, Jonathan. We've got, for one day. What a holiday. <laughs> for one day, we're gonna spend a day in Dusseldorf. What do you do on holiday? Shopping. Shop. <laughs> Jonathan's excited because it, we're gonna go and buy some shoes. This is a very secret shop that we found only once before, which only appears on a Tuesday. No, it doesn't. It appears when the tide is in a, at an equidistant um, trajectory to Actually, no, it's open every every day of the week, Sunday apart from Sunday. After 10 o'clock. <laughs> this is what I want, the shine. I can do this. <laughs> the There's so many shoes, Jonathan, to choose from. Yeah, they're ladies. You want to wear them, Jonathan? Sometime later, I was trying on every shoe. The shiny shoe. Yeah, Walk test. And wonderful, Jonathan, you've got two new pairs of shiny shoes. The one hour holiday continue. Oh, there's a lot of local pigeons here. Absolutely. Oh, and crap. Right, we're not going in there. Last time we were here, this church, we didn't go in, but this time it's got a bag on it. It's another church, Jonathan. Try the door. Go. Oh look, this is a lovely church. Beautiful. I remember this church, Jonathan. You played your famous arrangement now of Beethoven Fifth Symphony, the complete. Oh good. Oh good. It's open. So there you go, Jonathan. Do you know what the river is behind us? Is it the River Rhine again? It is, it is the River Rhine again. You couldn't make this up, could you? We have ended the vlog where we started on the River Rhine. I hope you've enjoyed watching some beautiful places. Jonathan, where have we been? Let's just recap. It's a large on yes, the Rhine. On the then Rhine. went to Rouvain. And yes. We visited a quick visit to uh, Luzon Cathedral as well. Indeed, yes. Uh, and then went to Munster. We have so seen Germany, some, yeah. France, Germany. We have seen some beautiful places, some beautiful organs. We always love reading your comments, so please do uh, leave us a comment and let us know what your favourite place was, your favourite organ, and maybe what your favourite organ stop was. Maybe <laughs> I think we can guess what that might have been. I know what my favourite one was. Okay, so thank you so much for watching, and uh, we'll see you on our next musical adventure. Okay, you take care, and we'll see you very soon. Okay, bye. bye.